Hey everybody, welcome back. We're going to do another awesome episode of Hearthstone Heroes of Warcraft. Um, we're going to go ahead and we're going to try to go for rank 18 um, at least to get a couple stars in. I'm one star in 19. We're on a win streak right now with our priest deck and we'll see how it goes. So if we can go ahead, maybe I'll try and fit in two games on this one and see, just to see how it goes. So let's go ahead and start it up. And it's about 14 to 20 seconds, which isn't too bad. Um, so the last couple games have been going pretty well. I haven't really had a huge amount of trouble. The last guy we played that hunter was, uh, he was a little bit of a challenge. So, oh, oh, I don't know what happened there, but we're going to see how well this goes. This is an open beta still, so they're still working things out. All right, cool. I am facing another priest. Priest versus priest decks are actually really interesting because, um, this is basically going to say, you know, who's got what cards, you know, that are better. So we're going to see how I can do this here. Definitely want to get minions on the board first. Um, that's going to be my main goal. So we're going to see what he does first. He knows I have everything that he does. So one card, one card. Don't see anything. Mm, not. I'm going to go ahead and coin this. Um, just to get an early card out. And then it's going to give me a card draw. <clears throat> it may have been a bad decision, but we'll see how it goes. Two, two, throws out a card, throws out a loot hoarder, so if I kill that card, I'm gonna end up gonna have to give him a card. Um What we'll do is we'll cancel out. And there's really nothing for me to do there, so I'm just gonna end it. I have decent removal right now with the holy smite so I I see he's gonna do card draw like i am which is a pretty good thing so it's either i take some damage or we'll see what happens so we're gonna go ahead and throw the card there and then i'm just gonna get, get two damage on the back um get him off the board get him another card because i mean i i like to keep board control that's just my play style there may be other ways you know things can be done but this is definitely the way that i play so if he doesn't have anything here, I can get an easy two damage, um, and then another card draw. Do you like to play with fire? Mm, not a bad card. Make him make it a two-two. Okay. Um, well. This will be interesting what I want to do here. Um, I could throw out my Northshire Cleric and heal and get another card, but that maybe that kind of seems like a waste. So I'm going to throw out my Enormous Inventor. He would give me a card anyway. Shadow Word Pain, not bad. I'm going to hit him directly. More than likely what's going to happen is he'll probably end up healing that card, casting a spell, doing more damage, destroying that. But what's going to happen is I'm probably going to Holy Nova um, very soon anyways. Yep. Oh, I guess this heal's not going to target a spell on that, so that's pretty good, actually. I enjoy that. That way he can't just spam heal to uh, do damage all around. Alright, I have... Five next round, so what I think I'll do is I will throw oh boy um one two three four yeah heal him up he'll give me a card from that no much inventor not bad hey, give me a minute. and then I'll probably end up playing um no much inventor again to get another card to generate more card draw like I said before earlier games card draw is definitely the way that you can get you know, ahead of the game because you're not going to be playing top deck. He's playing eight cards and I'm playing six. So right now he's got quite a bit of choice as far as he could have a lot of removal or he could have some late game stuff or another wild pyromancer. He can do whatever he pleases. Um, or you know what I can do is I can just waste a Holy Nova and I'll get one card and I'll end up getting two cards out of it. Um, ah, yeah, no, can't do that anymore. Oh. It's 
good play to get rid of those cards. So I'll cancel this card out. Um, he's got really nothing left, so I'll just do a good cancel. He's wasting cards to get rid of them, so I'm okay. Light spawn. I don't have a divine spirit yet, so I'm not going to worry about that. That'll be a good trade-off. Then what I'll do is I'll go ahead and throw out another uh, No Mission Venter. Got a taunt off it, and there's nothing for me to spend my heal on, so I'm just going to go ahead and end my turn. Right now I have a Word Death, Holy Nova, Holy Nova, and a Mind Control. Can't use the Mind Control yet till later game, but the Holy Nova is going to come in handy. Um, if he starts throwing low minions on the board, I can end up wiping them out. Or if he throws a nice big taunt, I get a nice Shadow Word Death waiting for him anyways. He's got nothing. Alright, so don't have a lot of pressure. I want to keep cards in my hand. We um, must we'll go ahead and buff him up. Well. And then we'll just Give go ahead and hit him for three. Truth is my shield. Alright, so a 4 5. You can deal two damage, get rid of that. This may be a good card to actually just taunt out. Divine Shield is one of those things that can get quite annoying. Um, oh, it's five or more. Darn it. Nice try on my part. Didn't really think that much through. Um, hmm. What do I want to do here? I must consider... Well, I could throw out my taunt. I'll hit him with that. Heal him back up. Not really going to do too much, but he's got to hit my taunt anyways. That way, next round, if he doesn't get rid of this taunt with either a Shadow Word Pain um, or anything like that, I have the availability to have him try to attack it, and then, oh, he's going to play with that card. Um, and it's probably a Shadow Word, yep. Not bad, not bad, not bad. And then, he's going to put two metal towards him. He's going to try and burn me down now. I want to put on my North Shark Cleric and get me an extra card. Hmm. This is a tough one. This is a tough one. Must um, consider. That's going to be three, which is going to leave me six left. Then I could end up throwing out like... Yeah, let's go is ahead and do injured? that. Hard. Mind control, not bad. Um, I'm gonna throw out my Yeti. Hey, give me a minute. That way I'll make him a 3-2, and then if he heals him up, he can only be up to a 4, and my Yeti will take him out. They're gonna want to force one attack at least on my cleric just to get him out of the way, or else I'm gonna keep getting card draw. Gonna make that a three four and then I don't know my shield for oh yeah see he healed him so that way I get a card out now I think this next play I'm gonna take his card and make it a and take his taunt to do a five six oh. hmm. now I'm not quite sure I'll probably just remove that taunt then and then steal my his shield for other Argus. one um, let's see what I want to do here. This is a, this is quite a tough one. Um, no, you know what? We're gonna end up. All right. I just want to do this just to get his board clear, and then I get help to myself. I know it's kind of stupid, but hey, I got board control out of it. Give me a minute. 
and he's down to 18. I'm back up to 30. I think it was well a pretty good played. play. Yep, awesome. Thank you. I appreciate that, man. Um, like I said, I like board control, so he wasted quite a bit of cards just to see if he get that upper hand. But with those two holy, uh, holy novas there to remove them, everything panned out super well. All right, he's got a 3-5. I'm going to wait on that. What I'm going to do now is I'll probably... Well, you know what I'll do is I'll throw out my Light Spawn. I'll throw out a Divine Spirit. And then I'll also throw out a Chilling Betty. From there, I will smack him and then make him a 3 2, three, two. If he has a Mind Control and steals it, whatever, I'll just steal mine back. That way... Um, we're doing okay. He's in a, oh no, he showered death it. Not bad. And then what you got there, dude? Heal yourself back up to a 3-4. Not bad. Yep, do it. <laughs> you don't know what you want to do. You might as well take that out. It's going to be a trade. But I'm going to trade back anyways. Swamp ooze. <clears throat> let's do this let's mind control him just to give him a little bit of a scare we'll trade off and I'll keep board control again not bad not bad that way everything's evened out now and he's healing himself back up so 24 28 me divine spirit i don't have my other um i don't have my other light spawn yet so right now there's nothing on the board so i'll just throw out my crocless keep it low just in case there's anything that he wants to decide to take what i'm hoping for is a light spawn that way I can Divine Spirit and then Power Wheel show to make him a 12-12. Wow, he's got nothing. What is going on here? Alright, um... Wow. I guess I'll just... I guess I'll just throw that out. I mean, it's really the only thing I have. Everything else are spells and removal. So if he throws out anything high, I'm just going to remove it right away. I haven't seen... Let's see how much I got. I got six cards left. I have um, another light spawn I know for sure. I still have Valen um, that I could play out that'll do that. Hmm. I think I'm going to ruin this guy's day. I think that's what I'm gonna, oh well. 5-5. Five, five. I could power wield shield. Nope. I'm just gonna use Shadow War Death and remove it. We'll just call it that way. That way I don't have to worry about it. And then I will just go ahead and start pounding on here. 30-20, my lead. I don't know what else he's got. He's definitely going to want to use that to keep himself alive since he has nothing on the board. There's nothing that I have right now that I'm really worried about. Um, I really want to get that light spawn. That would be really, really nice to have. That way I can have a 14-14 um, by the time it's done. But I I don't really know what he has. He might, yeah, there it is, right there. Cool. Um, hmm. I'm going to play it first before I put out any spells towards it because I want to see what he has. If he has a Shadow Word Death or anything like that, because what could happen is he could have either a Mind Control, Shadow Word Death, or whatnot. And I don't want to waste, you know, three cards on him just to get, Truth you know, removed. Taunt Divine Shield. Yep, that's exactly what I'm glad that I did. I'm glad I put him out first and didn't play my cards. Is someone injured? And then a Northshire Cleric. So, what I'm going to do this round is. I'm going to mind control this guy, take him, get him a little bit upset, um, that way 
He's kind of fearing up. He may concede. I don't know. But let's see what he's got. I have three cards left. One of them is my legendary. It's really sad that he has he doesn't have a mind Okay, I was gonna say it's really sad that you don't have a mind control in that deck, dude. That's very, very disappointing. Da da Prophet Valen. Now Um I'm not gonna play him yet until this guy is removed. So heal him up. See what he's got here. Three. Let's bring him up another two health. Still of cards. Let's go ahead and play that card. Get another card draw. And I'm out of cards. I'm out. So I gotta get rid of this guy quick, or else I'm gonna start fatiguing. But I have quite a bit of health where Prophet Valum's gonna keep me alive for quite a bit. He's got five cards left. I have no. I, I don't want to play that just because. Um, I don't want an extra one damage done to me if I don't need it. Um, if either way, one of my guys is gonna get healed up to deal two damage. Nice play. Nice play. Pass me that arc light nice play. Is someone injured? All right. Fatigue. Seven seven. I don't know what that card is, so we're gonna play this card. Um, I'm going to then Shadow Word Pain this card. No, well, yeah, let's Shadow Word Pain that one. Is it my turn? He's down to two cards? Yep, two cards. He's gonna heal that guy back up to a 4-5. That's the most obnoxious card too because I have Shadow or Death and it won't take his card out at all. Oh boy, this is gonna get very, very frustrating. All right. Let's go ahead and throw this out. Um, Almost out of cards. All right, this is <laughs> this is gonna get very interesting. He's lasted himself out, and this is. Oh no! All right, I have no choice. I have to shadow or death it. I have to get rid of it, um, or else things are gonna get starting getting really, really bad. And I have no cards left either. Um, I think he beat me, you guys. This is um, kind of upsetting. I'm not very happy about that. Negative three. I have to take that card out. I have no cards. Uh, GG. You have bested. Kind of upsetting, but what can you do? I mean, you win some, you lose some. I'm not gonna, you know, throw a fit about it. That was a good game. Priest first priest decks um, really show how things can end in the end. But hey, they're very frustrating. Let's go and try again. We got a warlock. Shall bring now, warlocks, they like to control the board, so I need to get things up quick. 
Um, get rid of the four fours, get something real quick. Um, Holy Smite will be awesome removal at first. That'll get rid of usually his taunt. The Shadow Ward Pain is going to help with that. Um, it's probably one of the more obnoxious taunts. Shadow Ward Death is going to help get rid of anything I don't have right now. So I'm just going to wait it out. Um, Warlocks are really nice because they don't have any... Um, like, they don't have card loss. They just have the availability to where they can life tap and get another card even though they're going to sacrifice in life but if a warlock deck set up really well um it's not going to matter taunt i'll remove it see i'm draining cards and he just keeps getting them out there um should be another interesting game this is probably a drain life maybe Shadow Bolt. Nope, didn't want to do anything. Alright, let's start with a Chill Wind Yeti. Get that on the board. Do you have anything to remove that? Okay. At the start of your turn, destroy it. So this is going to get rid of, I might as well uh, deal an extra 4 damage to him. I mean... That's really the only thing that I have an option for. Someone called it. Or I could play my cleric, hit him to remove that. That's what I'll probably. That's what I'm gonna do. Play my cleric. I am then going to remove him, heal him up, give me a card, light spawn. Not gonna waste that card on him. It's gone. All right. I would prefer to get a card draw because um, I don't really feel like losing any cards, but we'll see how it goes. I have no cards to spawn right now. There goes a coin. Um, this the is probably one of his bigger. Yep. Um, I'm just going to Shadow Word Death it. Oh, cool. Another one. Now I really don't have to worry about it. Right away. And then I'll just hit a measly one. Blood imps are a pain in the butt. They're a, ooh, they're a pain. Um. All right. Um. What do I want to do here? I don't want a holy nova because it's gonna enrage him. But then after I do that. Let's just throw out my light spawn, um, and then right I'll away. hit him directly. Because if if worse comes to worse, what I'll do is I'll probably end up holy nova to get rid of the imp, anything else that he throws out, and then I'll end up shadow or deathing the Gurubashi, because now he's going to be a five five. So he just drained a card for that, got nowhere, is playing another card. Now I have a choice to make. If I really wanted to be a jerk, I'll sacrifice. I'll trade off. Hmm. Which is what I'm going to do. Then what I'll do, play my Yeti, Shadow or Death. That's probably the good play. Got rid of his big cards. Uh, he still has the Blood Imp, which I want to get rid of. And then from there, I will... Maybe Holy Nova if he gets more stuff out. Doesn't look like he has a card. Now he does. Another Guru Bashi Berserker. Awesome. Don't be surprised, sir, because I'm probably going to take that card from you since I have another mind control to waste. So. 
I'm gonna give this minion um, two health just so I can get another card out there. Then I'll go ahead and buff him to make him a 5 8. And then I'll just go ahead and. Bam. Um, you know what, too? I'm going. Mm, Do I want to self-enrage him now or later? We'll just wait. Sorry, I can't. I'm, I'm not really making up my mind. Sometimes I just can't make up the decision that quick or else I make a bad choice. So I'm going to have 10 next round. Wasted a shadow bolt on it. Wasted a drain life. And what else you can do? And you are going to waste another drain life. This is why I like doing this with my pre stack because of this reason here. I have the availability to get him to use cards just to get rid of one guy. Awesome, love it. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and just take his berserker and get him a little bit of a jump scare. So four four card. I'm right now ahead 30 to 25. Next round, core hound. Sh should I should I just be like, hey, I'm gonna take that next? We must cleanse the sun well. I mean, why not? I mean, he's probably thinking, oh, great, now I can make him a 10-7, and then I can just be mean and take it. But I don't know. Like I said, I don't know what he has. Um, here 10 that's gonna restore oh see he's still got 10 health I don't like that um I wonder. actually what I'll do is I will throw out a holy nova Zoop. take out those two that's now a five um I'm gonna throw out my this is going to be forced to hit that card. Unless he has something to remove that card, um, then I'm going to take direct damage. For so he's going to make that back to a 10-7, 20, you know, 30-20, and a Divine Shield. And then... What's he got there? What's he corrupting? He's corrupting my Gurubashi Berserker. Okay. So he's gonna force me to take that card out. Which is fine. I mean I'll take that card out. That's fine. I'll just throw out a rivulous croc and then pretty much just call it that. Not really worried about the divine protector. Alright, so sun well. that's good. you're gonna make that a what? 5-6. Deal more damage yourself because you need a card. You don't want to keep playing top deck. And you're gonna do direct damage to me. That's cool. I don't mind. Go ahead, do your damage. Alright, end the turn. Let's get another card draw. No much inventor. Gonna throw it out. Get a card draw. What do we got? Northshire Cleric could come in handy for later, so I'm gonna wait on it because these guys can just pop it out with one hit. Um, sure, why not? Let's go ahead and give me uh, two health and then I'm going to trade. I still have a healer, I still have a mind control. I'm gonna keep that just in case I get in a sticky situation. I use my mind control a little bit too quick last round. Just trying to get some uh, card draw here. Let's see what we're sitting at. We're sitting at a 7 to 11. Four damage to my inventor. Knock him out. And then he'll probably trade. Or he won't trade. He's going to get rid of my healer. So that he can keep board control. Warlocks love having board control. Power word shield. Hmm. That'd be a what? A five? But that's still not gonna do it for me. I could throw out that card, kill myself up, 
Throw out this card, get a card draw. Shadow Word Pain. Perfect to get rid of that Divine Shield, but I'm going to wait on it. There could be something else. I'm not too worried about it yet. I am the Blade of the Gods. Like that. That's what I was going to hope waiting for. going for here dude this will be interesting um okay let's um let's do this go ahead and throw out my cleric um we will holy nova um Shadow Word Pain. This isn't my main goal here, but. And then we'll go ahead and heal him up again, and then I'll get another card draw out of it. Two novice engineers, so two characters. Eh, why not? Just to get board control. He's sitting at four, and I'm sitting at six. I don't know what's up with these games today where it's just gonna last forever. I still have another light spawn and a divine spirit, and then I still have my Prince Valen. I think I have another mind control too, if I'm not mistaken, because I haven't used one yet. River Croc. Let's go ahead and throw out this and get another card draw. Low card for another card draw. There's my divine spirit. Let's go for it again. Um, Prince Valen, not bad, not bad. Um, what I think I'll do on this one is... I will heal him for another card draw. This means if I'm getting these card draws, I need to end this quick. So what we'll do then is we will... I don't want to make sure he has a Hellfire, so I'm going to keep my stuff low. Where that will... Oh, no. Right away. I did my math wrong. He'll trade. I know he will. He'll trade. Next round, I think I'll throw out my Prof... Oh, that... I don't know if I want to throw out Prophet Valen yet. I do and I don't. I'm sitting at 2-2 two, two, and he's sitting at 2. Handle it. Okay, that makes that a 5-1. Behold the might of okay. This is the card that I'm going to end up taking. I'm going to end up taking that card. Because... Um, it's going to scare the boogas out of him. I don't even know if that's a real word. Whatever. Don't oh, care. Good trade. And then from here, we'll go ahead right and sure. hit him directly to make it 12. Almost He's almost out of cards. We're doing 1-1 one, one there. Thank you. He has nothing. He's going to start running in fatigue soon. I have no time for games. Uh, take control of a random enemy. That's if he dies. So he has no taunt available. Okay, light spawn. I don't want to throw any of my big cards out just because, um, yeah. So you know what? Here's what I'm gonna oh, do. If you're sure. Any of my random he can have all the little minions for all I care. That's totally cool with me. Um one day. And he has no choice but to hit he's probably gonna hit this card. Just be no. Okay, he's gonna hit that card. And he's hoping that he's gonna get he's gonna get that. He did. Go figure. Well, I could scare the crap out of him and then just play two light spawns. Or a light spawn and then double double to make it a 20. Right away. And just see what happens.
If he doesn't have anything to remove this, it's GG. What's up? I don't know what's up with these games and uh yeah. Goodbye. Awesome. I picked up a win. Um, like I said, Warlocks are a little bit tricky. Never seen two games in a row where I fatigued, but I picked up a win off it. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this for now, and then hopefully we'll pick up next episode so that I can try and get rank 18. i got to win three games to get 18 um, because I don't have... Well, actually, I need to win two games because one more... You win three games in a row, and that gives you a win streak for an extra star. So we've already won one, so two more games, and that will bring us up to 18. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I'll see you next time.